have proved that you fight well. Now you can join us. Keep cutting. Wake up, check your phone. Ignore the alarm, you're still alone. Wake up, rewind the night. Who are you? But also kind of who am I? Wake up, check your phone. Tweet party for the apocalypse. Don't forget to RSVP. Hey guys, it's Rihanna. Welcome or welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today I'm actually doing something very exciting. I'm going to downtown Toronto, like Queen Street. Like I live suburbia Toronto, so we're going actually downtown. I'm going with a friend and I thought I would vlog it and get ready. So I'm going to start off by putting some makeup and you guys have seen me do my makeup so many times. So I'm going to just fast forward this one. So as you can see, on this day, I had a really bad hormonal breakout that I couldn't really control. But I left it in the video because I wanted to show that having acne is completely normal. You are beautiful with or without your acne. Makeup is on. And then for my hair, because I just washed it, I'm just going to take this curl enhancing smoothie by Shea Moisture and put some of that on. I am literally already late and I need to go pick up my friend. So we're gonna go now. We'll see you guys probably when I'm on the train. <laughs> so we made it to the bus. Hey! <laughs> it's with Sharon. Um, I thought we were not at the right place, but we're at the right place. And now we have to wait for the bus for like 10-ish minutes, but yeah. So this is what I ended up wearing. So I'm just wearing this like cropped, what am I saying? This tank top, this ripped tank top from, I want to say like M Boutique. Skirt I wear all the time from American Eagle and my bands that I love so much. And that's it. It's a really hot day so we needed to wear as minimal clothing as possible. Yeah. <laughs> I'm wearing this tube top that my grandma gave me. And this belt from my mom. <laughs> These jeans for my brother, and these shoes that I thrifted. Wow, eco friendly <laughs> queen! Blue, these gray uh, green sweatpants and this star choker and that's all I think I'll buy because I don't have enough money for brand new milk. Not the bag, spent 85 Canadian dollars. That's like two babysitting rounds but it's okay, we got the goods. Turn around, it wasn't you. I was looking at myself. I couldn't so we're sitting in Trinity Bellwoods Park. It's so pretty here. We're in the shade. It's so nice. I just got um the super green kale Caesar salad and fresh that we got it from is like all vegan. So I'm really really happy and we're like really hungry. So I think we're just gonna eat and have a little bit. This morning when we were like waiting, we like walking to Brandy Melville, we passed by these gummies, like people giving out free gummies. And then we were sitting in the park and they were taking them and we were like, thank you for the gummies. Like they were walking back to like the store or whatever. 
and they gave us a whole pile of gummies, and they're so good. Thank you, Haribo gummies. We love you. <laughs> they were so good. They're so good. We were eating them in line. <laughs> Hi everyone, it's your fave, back at it again. Um, I'm learning how to vlog now, so maybe I can, ooh, maybe I can be a YouTuber in the future. I can steal David Dobrik's career, because that's really what we're going for. Um, my hair is kind of a mess, but we put this little thing on that I stole from my mom, and thanks, mommy. And yeah, the scene tower's in the back. I don't know if you can see it, but it's there. Yeah, thanks for watching. downtown and I'm okay He's got it all figured out That's what they all say, yeah Everyone's looking at me, thinking that I'm different It's, okay, we completely wrecked it, but it's so good And it's purple, my favorite color It's from I Halo Crunch Yeah And on Queen Street West So if you're in Toronto by any chance um, It's very expensive, it's like six dollars but, anyway. but it's worth it mm -hmm. Downtown and I'm okay. Eyes on me, I don't know what to do, so I smile and I wait. Hey guys, so it's the next day, it's Sunday. Um, because yesterday we ended up coming home. The bus was 4.50, so I got home closer to 6. And we were just like really tired. Like I was so tired, I literally did nothing. So it's the next day, and I thought I would do a mini haul of the clothes I got from Brandy Mobile. So the first thing I picked up were these green sweatpants. So I really like brandy sweats. I have them in a dark gray and a light gray, but these are a little bit different of a fit. They're like tighter. The other sweatpants are looser. Um, and these are 45 Canadian dollars. Brandy Mobile is more expensive in Canada because Canadian dollars. But anyways, they're really nice. I like that they cinch at the bottom. They're really soft. They're not really for summer, but I'm gonna definitely get a lot of use out of them in winter. I can wear these with a tank top, with a long sleeve shirt, with a hoodie. Really style them anyway, and I just really like them. And I really like Brandy Mobile sweatpants. The second thing I picked up was this blue tank top that I'm wearing right now. Um, you can see in the trial clips. And this was 20 Canadian dollars, which honestly isn't bad for a tank top. It's a really like nice um, ribs material, and it's a little bit, it's definitely cropped, but I like that it's like tight and yeah, it just looks nice, and I thought I could wear this with sweatpants or with jeans, um, under hoodies, like in the winter, in the summer, and I thought I would get a lot of use out of it. And then the last thing I picked up was the necklace I'm wearing right now. It's just this, like, star choker necklace. They had so much jewelry there, like a lot of gold and silver jewelry, but I only like wearing silver jewelry, and I just, like, I really like this. It was 11 Canadian dollars and came in this cute little bag another nice thing about this necklace is that it has like three points where you can tie it so it could go lower or tighter if you wanted and i thought it would just be good to wear with casual clothes or like with hoodies so brandy mobile ended up taking a good chunk of our day yesterday because we waited in line for about an hour and a half and that was because there's only one brandy mobile in all of ontario and they were only allowed 15 people in the store, which resulted in a big line. And we were there on a Saturday, so I would definitely go again, but I would go on like the middle of the week, right when it opened, because we were there at 11.40 a.m., so like a pretty busy time. So waiting was not the best experience, because it was pretty boring, but I was there with like my friends, so it wasn't that bad. And, and there was like shade, like trees and stuff, and at one point you could even sit on a bench. But by the time we actually got into the store, it was a really, like, a really good experience. Like, the store was very, very well stocked, especially when we went. They had so many different types of tank tops, like this, in so many colors. They had lots of t-shirts. They had hoodies. They had so many types of sweatpants, like, 
probably like six or seven types of sweatpants, like knit sweaters. They had so many types of dresses and skirts, like flowy skirts, tighter skirts, dresses, wrap dresses. I would have even bought more, but I already spent like $85, so I was like, maybe I should wait till next time to buy more. But if I had like unlimited money, it's so easy to spend money there. So yeah, the store was a good experience. Also in Ontario, like in the Toronto Brandy Melville, they're honestly really nice. Like I've never had a bad experience with like the people working there. They were really nice. Um, one girl even like helped me find sweatpants. Me and my friend like we're not typically like brandy girls. Like we don't have that body type, but they were still really really nice. Like yeah, and honestly it was like super air conditioned in the store. And because there were only 15 people in the store at a time, by the time you actually got in, like you weren't rushed and it wasn't crowded at all. Like we stood at the mirror taking pictures for five minutes. Nobody looked at us. So yeah, it was a really good experience once I got in the store. But those are the three things I picked up. So I hope you enjoyed watching my little day on Queen Street and my little brandy haul. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed the video. So uh, you can subscribe down below for more content. And I'll see you guys in next week's video. Thanks for watching. Bye.